The Dark Ones came much later. From the... Well, I used to live nearby. Before the war, I mean, uh, up there. I was on the train when it happened. I tried calling my family, but couldn't get through. What the? What happened? Shit! 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 What's going on here? Wake up, Artyom. It's me, Khan. Nightmares, eh? No wonder, after all you've been through. Listen, I have incredible news. A couple of days ago, I was near the ruins of the Dark One's hive, and I saw one of them, still alive. I immediately set out to find you, as you were the one they tried to contact, before you launched the missile strike against them. Khan! How the hell did you get here? Get out! Now! Yes, Ullman, one moment. If a Dark One has survived, it is vital that you try to speak with it, Artyom. I realize that, as one of the Order now, you report to Miller. But we must persuade him to allow this mission. Khan, I told you to get out! This is a classified base. You shouldn't even be here. I'll take you to Colonel Miller. Follow me, Artyom. Get ready, Artyom. I'll be waiting at the exit. Move it, you windbag! I knew a smoker once. During the last year of his life, he had to eat, drink, and breathe through a tiny hole in his throat. a while ago, but I still can't... Привет, Артём! Артём was one of the men who found D6. They gave him a ranger's badge on the spot. Yeah, that's nice for him. I had to spend two years as a cadet before they accepted me into the Order. Well, anyway, uh, where were we? Strange place, this D6. I didn't know they ever built bunkers this large. The story is, construction started in Stalin's time and went on until the USSR broke down. War was inevitable, they said. The people believed in a better future. Our leaders put their money on Armageddon. And did D6 save them? No. They couldn't reach it in time. And here, it stood for 30 years until our guys stumbled on it. Everything inside was untouched. Weapons, medicine. <laughs> like finding buried treasure, eh? I suppose it's nice down here since they got the reactor working. The lights, the heat. But still, it doesn't feel right. Like, it's too damn good, you know? Quit whining. It's a gift from your ancestors. Enough to survive down here for decades. Maybe until the world up there will take us back. This is a secret base, boy. You shouldn't be hanging about. Group. Romanov. I thought he was in the hospital from the attack on the Great Library. He 
This charged last week, so his squad is sent through the marshes to the George base. And Romanov's the only one who makes it there alive. You're shitting me! The rest of the group? Wiped out? The marshes are easy. You just look for the markers and flags and walk along them so you don't drown. A child could do it. Well, okay, the shrimps always gave you hell. But come on, what could take a whole squad down? No idea. They found Romanov's alone at the church, sitting on the floor praying. Since then, he doesn't eat, doesn't react to people, he just speaks to God. <laughs> Hope Romanov's not expecting an answer. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, Artyom. Welcome to the armory. I hear you are a ranger now, huh? We must get a drink some time to celebrate. For now, let's get you equipped. So, first things first. You're going to need a gas mask. You can't make a step on the surface without a gas mask. It's been 20 years and the radiation's still strong enough in some places to boil water. There are hot spots down here in the metro, too. Don't forget filters for the mask. Sure, it looks cool enough even without these, but they definitely make it better for your health. Now, med kits. Well, what can I say? Anything you need for survival in a stylish orange case. Here's your advanced salary for this month. Remember, your pay is in military-grade rounds. Sure, you can use them as usual ammo for some hefty extra damage, but saving them to buy guns, attachments, regular ammo and equipment from merchants anywhere in the metro seems like a smarter move. Take the ones you want and try them out on my range. Rangers usually carry up to three weapons, Artyom, and the choice of those is completely up to you. I always carry a pistol. Sturdy, reliable, and...
this? What are you aiming at? Fucking sniper! I'll train you so you can hit the target with your ice floor! Even if I have to fly you bastards myself! Now get out of my sight! to this clown, Alex. Open the gates! Have you heard about Lesnitsky? What are you talking about? Check with the guards at the lab. Shit. What the hell did he do? Alright, let's go. The tombs of ancient kings were filled with whatever they might need in the afterlife. Weapons, gold, chariots. They'd sacrifice their wives and slaves to serve their lords even in death. It reminds me of this banker. Sir, cut that shit out! The things in D6 are like what the conqueror took with him beyond the grave. Cold steel and wild steeds, and treasures untold. Of course, the Tomb Raiders would always die horribly, killed by demons or ghosts, or their own greed. Khan, will you shut up or what? Okay, I heard that Lesnitsky did something. What happened? Nobody knows. Lesnitsky was at the lab. When the next shift came, the door was open, and the lab ransacked. Lesnitsky was gone! Shit! So, what's inside? Chemical weapons, maybe some other shit. That's, that's all I heard. God damn it. The Colonel's going to tear me a new one because of Lesnitsky. A red hot poker right into my soul. If I still have one. All right, let's go. We might control D6, but it's like a damn city down here. All the bunkers, the nooks and crannies and exits just came back still. The they face the they say the cancer is strengthening the sentry. Miller ordered all our men assembled here on this base. Kerman, take these guys to Miller. They've been summoned. Yes, sir. All right, go on in. I'll wait here. When you've gone, I'll speak to Miller. The bombing of the Dark Ones may have been humanity's worst mistake. What if they meant us no harm, but were trying to communicate? Perhaps the severe pain and loss of consciousness suffered in their presence just meant we were incompatible. Machines with different wires. But somehow you are the have the common wire. The connection with the Dark Ones. Yes. People died at Exhibition. Your home station. Hunter, the best of the Order, is most likely dead as well. And he taught you this. If we don't fight for our lives in this new world, we'll be devoured. It is the law of evolution. But, I would argue, the old laws no longer apply. All right, Tartu, and you, God, you have something to report? Yes, Colonel. Let's keep it short, then. I located the surviving Dark One at the gardens. What? One of those things is still alive? Luckily, yes. Luckily? Come, this is utter madness. 
The Dark Ones were the greatest threat the Order's ever faced. Colonel, just give me a chance. A single Dark One is no threat. Artyom has a gift. I believe he can establish contact with the creature. Let him come with me. All right. Artyom, go with Khan to the gardens and locate the Dark One. I'll send a sniper along. My best. Anna. Yes, sir. Why would we need a sniper? To eliminate the creature and finish the Order's job. Milord, you can't! It's murder! Restrain him! You idiot! You're making the same mistake that... We're done here. Escort Khan out of here. Artyom! It's your last chance for forgiveness! For getting rid of the nightmares! Ah! Forget about Khan. Looks like he got close. Too close to the creature and lost his mind. Look here, Artyom. Complete the mission and get back here quickly. A war is coming and I'll need every ranger at his post. On your way. So, what are you waiting for? Come along, rabbit. Artyom, if it's true, and don't forget to finish it with a headshot. We now suspect that Nitsky is asleep on it. But we haven't verified who's running. Don't tell me you believe that bullshit about making peace with the Dark Ones. I wish I had been up in that tower myself to see the missiles fall and watch them burn in their nests. Come on, Rabbit. Would you let those things into the Metro? Let them crawl into our brains so they could use us like animals. Maybe we could mate with them so the children could live on the surface and feed off the radiation. Shit. You don't shake hands with the devil. Please step away from the edge of the platform. Trade coming in. Worn this place out. Let's move. Just a year ago, I stood on top of the In the past, trains were ordinary things. But now, this monorail seems magic, doesn't it? Our kids won't know how to operate these things. And their kids will probably think this was built by the gods. Sign, Rabbit. Maybe we'll have luck with this mission, too. Power's working. Open the gate. I'll cover the passage. Great. You did fine after all. I don't think we'll run into anything serious here. 
Great, the ladder. It's just a little more walking. Then we'll see if you're rather tall. Surface, put your mask on. <sighs> With looking at my ass, it's way out of your reach, rabbit. Give me a hand here. Let's go to the main entrance. There's a good shooting position there. I can cover a lot of territory. You're supposed to be immune to there. What? Influence? Well, I don't have your gift. So hop along, rabbit. Head on in and look for the creature. I'm thinking that since the Dark Ones are so fond of you, it'll sense you, or smell you, or whatever the fuck they do, and come from hiding. Just try to stay in the open so I can cover you. We'll maintain radio contact. And if you have second thoughts, don't worry. I'll do it. Okay then. Good luck. I'm in position. I can see you. Something's still burning where the nest was. That's some fine wasteland. You guys sure did a good job here. The creature I met in the burn. Herr Sturmführer, these prisoners were captured at the botanical gardens. Seems like they were looking for something. These two are red. They refuse to speak. 
The third one looks like a ranger of the order. A mutant the size of a child was caught near him. It was delivered to Reich as well. I'll deal with it later. This one. Suspected mutation. No, no, I'm normal. See, two arms, two legs, ten fingers. Don't you understand? I'm a Hansa citizen. Shut up! You're uh -huh. not in Hansa. Here, you are a suspect in the distribution of corrupted genes. Hey. And this is your trial. If your skull has the correct proportions, you are free to go. If not, you are an abomination. Science, you see. This is an outrage! I told you to stay still! Well? Let's see. 318 millimeters by... Uh, 302. Let's look it up in the table. Ah, congratulations. You're a mutant. No, no, please! To the garbage shoot. A silver question. What was your mission in the garbage? Go to hell yourself. Nazi. I'm gonna count to three. One. Glory to the red line! Two. Long live covered Mothman! Three. Please. Please, I'll, I'll talk. I'll talk. But, but, but away from the other side. They'll kill me if they hear. Okay? Take this one to the second unit. Usually, Reich does not interfere with the Order's business. But here, we have you, the Reds, and the Freak, all caught in the same net. I do not like it. So talk, or take a bullet to the brain. Get the officer! Hey, you! Keep it. So, uh, you are with the Spartan Order? I'm from the Red Line. Uh, our superiors are not on the best of terms, huh? But I say fuck that. No, fuck that. The grunts stick together, huh? <laughs> the fuck? I see. Oh, you see. Remotely controlled lock. One thing's for sure. Our only chance of getting out of this alive, work together. Right. Now, what did they say about the garbage? Shoot. Okay. Let's get our asses out of this place. Then we'll go our separate ways. Huh? See the pipes? This is their contingency plan. There's a riot or an escape that just opened the valve and turned the prison into one big gas chamber. Suki. Sure learned from their predecessors. Shh. We'll go as soon as the elevator leaves. Let's move. Sweet mother of God. I heard rumors of a concentration camp here, but to see it with my own eyes. Bleacha mucha. There's a tunnel on the other side. Okay, I lead, you follow. Now keep it quiet or they'll guess everyone. Let's move. Stay out of the light and stick to the shadows. They are your best friend. Okay, tak, 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 tak. Looks like we cleared it. Let's see, let's see... A great... Mm. Ah, well, yeah. Tough luck, didn't even budge, huh? All right, we can't go through here, that we know. Okay, where do we go now, huh? What if... Hey! Hey! Give me a lift, will you? Get up here! Shh! Duck, duck. Now listen. Pretend you're a little fucking mouse. 
Get down. Don't make any sudden moves. See? Now let's move. Two fingers each like huh? Lord. You can do nothing but harm. And we will save Freeze. innocent lives just by shooting you. No, we're not going to shoot you. Thank you, Thank you. Move! They deserve nothing more than hang. And it's a good show as well. <laughs> Follow me! I quite agree with you. Fiora is infallible. Of course. The hanged man empties his bowels, and we have to clean it up. Okay, it's you take the right one, I the left one. Yes, I will distract do. mine, then you take yours Please. down. Verstehen? Please. Get to it. Don't start too soon, huh? Let's do it! <laughs> How's this? <laughs> You're lucky. I was afraid you'd squeal. Hey, baby, look. Get as many of them as you can. We're done anyway. You're gonna do squat besides get us all killed. As if we'd waste any on you. What do you mean you released him? Are you out of your mind? I don't know. Just looked at him and somehow saw myself. And that trader from Hansa kept pestering me to sell the creature. Said it would be a waste to shoot it, that he'd pay good money, so I just... Show me the bullets. Sure, sure, look. I'm ready to share. It's too much for me alone. Just don't tell the overshuffle. I got two hundred. Well, well, why are you walking around here? It's just that our shift is in. Then you have no further business here. Off to the barracks with you. Yes, Herr Oberschaffure. You made it. <laughs> My lady, it's a true hero. Now we need to get them to open the airlock from the other side. One moment. Anything? So impatient. What kind of joke is this? Come on, quit hiding. Fritz, is that you? Damn it. I'm not gonna open next time. It's not even funny. Yeah, let's play the fucking hide and seek now. Like freaking kids. Let us out. Let us out. There's a control panel up there. You can open all this. Get out of the inner block, and the fun is just starting, Billion. Here, catch this. Hmm. Nice watch. Huh, ah, this little blue indicator, it lights up when you're visible, right? Huh? All right, there's bound to be more guards further ahead, but they won't be able to use gas. We can really let ourselves go. Ah, I wish I had a grenade. I'll break two in the dark. Let's move here. Yeah. You take the lower route, I'll take the top and cover you.
coming down. No, there's nothing on the shelf. Open your eyes, it's there, in the box. How are you, Chuvak? All right? Oh, you are tough, huh? No wonder they made you a ranger. Follow me, don't stop. Security, make way! Right! Fortune has smiled upon us. Our scouts have located a real treasure trove. A legendary D6 bunker complex. Huge storage facility filled with supplies. There is medicine, and enough canned food to sustain the Reich for a hundred years. And enough weapons for us to wipe the freaks and genetically impure from the face of the earth. has been seized and occupied by Sparta. Corrupt hands and the greedy raids are also bearing their poison fangs to strike and steal what's rightfully yours. But we will never let them have it! Hell right! <laughs> we must prepare for a great war! The final war! And it will end with the triumph of our race! The mailed fist of the legions of Reich will challenge our enemies! And if the jackals will not surrender D6, we will take it by force! Hell Reich! What do you want? A jail break! Two Shoot prisoners have murdered the guards and escaped! What the hell are you doing here then? Go get them! Hands up, you fuck! Look, through here! 
the impossible. Now I have to inform the Order that the Dark One is missing. What? Okay, looks like we lost them. Then we'd better hurry to the theater. There's nowhere else to go, huh? Chuvak. Are you alright, Chuvak? That's great. The armor works wonders. Shit! A dead end. Hold on! End of the line, huh? Well, there's no help in this. Поехали, we hook it from here. Follow me. Hmm. Well, I remember seeing this tunnel on the map. Phew, we're still on right there, though. Be careful. Whoppa! A pipe! Come here, Artyom! Okay, wait here while I look around. how many more of those bastards are lurking in the shadows. All I know is we better find them. See anything? Let's go check the dead end out while we are at it, just to make sure. Way the hell. Who goes there? Sure love to hit the bar right about now. Yeah, all the fun one needs. Uh, oh, 
same. I'm gonna get you! Is not the one I'm worried about. Right. Who knows how many more of those bastards are lurking in the shadows? All I know is we better find them. See anything? Let's go check the dead end out while we are at it, just to make sure. What? It's like actually somebody... Somebody definitely moved there. Oh, yeah. sleep deprivation does play its tricks. I should go and check. It's like actually somebody. Hey, boy! Go there! I'm locked! Where are you? It's definitely off here. Probably hold on somewhere, drinking, and letting me stand guard. I couldn't Assault. just imagine it. Shit, I have to check this out. Hey, hey that's a threat. What's that?
Checking up. Over. This is a fucking mess. A communist rat found in our tunnels. It's not the one I'm worried about. Right. Who knows how many more of those bastards are lurking in the shadows? All I know is we'd better find them. See anything? Let's go check the dead end out while we're at it. Just to make sure. Hey. Hey. <clears throat> <clears throat> Swear to It's not the one I'm worried about. Right. Who knows how many more of those bastards are lurking in the shadows? All I know is we'd better find them. See anything? Let's go check the dead end out while we're at it. Just to make sure. This rat found in our tunnels. It's not the one I'm worried about. Right. Who knows how many more of those bastards are lurking in the shadows? All I know is we'd better find them. See anything? Let's go check the dead end out while we're at it. Just to make sure. Hey! All clear. Over. Roger. Over. Huh? Hey. Looks 
place like this? What the? Hey, seems like someone. Well, it was just my imagination after all. Hey, boys! Come on out! I'm Where are you? Hey, what the hell was that? It's the damn drafts. Catching a call definitely seems a possibility now. He's got to be. Maybe I'll just shoot myself. Shit! Didn't seem quite right. Shit, I have to check this out. It's a threat. I surrender, you hear? I surrender! Let the big wigs duke it out! I've had enough!
knew you wouldn't abandon me. I knew it. You are a true comrade. I mean, you debt for life. Now get me out of here and I'll lead you home in no time. Fuck! Fuck, they're coming for me! Gonna take me to the noose! Good luck, my friend! You're my only hope now! Come on, get your ass out here, you fucking commie rat! And since she's a whore, tell her I'm coming for a visit. And be careful what you say about my kids, you fuck. Or the next ones will be your brothers and sisters. <laughs> Wait, don't kill him yet. I have to go take a leak. Wait till I come back. You shouldn't have let him go. If it choke you for a couple of minutes more, we'd give you a cartridge each. All right, we'll do that next time. You're here, no one is watching your stash. So what? I've got the only key. Look, you could at least tell me what's in there. All these secrets. No secrets at all. It's a gun I got off one of those pesky police rangers we whacked last week. Cool custom shit. Respect. Attention everyone. Roll call. Fuck, is there anyone alive there? Shit. They're getting on my nerves already. Will you go talk to them? Screw you. I went last time. Right, right, no big deal. I'll call myself. Farm here, over. Damn this old piece of crap, when are they going to fix it? <laughs> Sparks gone? Darn my ass. I told you, man, you shouldn't have sent that crab handed guy to the camp. He was useful. If he was a freak. Well, when we beat the shit out of Hansa, we'll have the techies, the whores, and whatever else you want 24 7 and all for free. But in the meantime, you could go to the bridge and check out what's smoking there. You could do that yourself just as well. <laughs> out again. Yeah, if you want something done, better do it yourself.
What the fuck do all you people want? While you left yours at the whorehouse. <laughs> yeah, that gun of yours is going to be so much fucking help when the Reds come for your ass. Lights out again. What the hell is up with it today? Can you take a look at it there while I try the switches here? Everything's a okay here. seen enough executions. Though I should think my son is here. He keeps misbehaving in school. He's going to wait for the whole students. What if they spare this man? Send him to dig tunnels. In your dreams, the noose is already with you. What good is watching a guy hang anywhere, huh? Jiggling with peace flowing down his leg. What happens? Put him around. And they hide the peace. Fuck that. It's for God. A bull that had a
lights. Check that fuse box. The lights are out again. I dragged Pavel out of the noose, and he says he's going to take me as close to Polis as possible. <laughs> That's the way to do it, bro! <laughs> Just like that. <laughs> That's the way to do it, bro. Just like the three musketeers, eh? If they were two.
cave in. Ah, looks like they blew the tunnel up. Well, maybe something on the other side they couldn't stop with bullets. Wait, 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 wait. I feel a draft. There's got to be a way through somewhere. Artyom, help me with this. Definitely no climbing up this one. Okay. Let's hope the elevator works all right. Yes! Generator online. Clear. Monsieur? Let's take this baby for a ride, huh? So, are we going? What the... When did it stop? Breakers out of what? Shit. Come on! They heard us. You may we're right in their fucking nest. Shit. It's a lot. It's got the wall! See its belly? That's the only vulnerable spot. Their top armor's just too tough. Okay, Artyom, if we run into one of these things, put your light on it till it flips belly up, you understand? The bastards hate the light more than anyone. Come on, follow me. Fucking bitch! Thanks, Chuak. One for all, huh? Here! The bridge. I heard about it. Theater shouldn't be far now. Oh. That's high. Let's move! Gah! Them again! Hold them off, Artyom! I'll try to get us over! Great! This will do it! Artyom! Artyom! Come help me pull this out!
Артем, come on, let's go. Light, there, let's go. How do you like this, huh? How do you like this, bitches? What? Okay, we're safe here. Wait a minute, Artem, it's it's bad without the light. Let me make a torch or something. All right. Light up! All right, let's go! Shit! Artyom! Keep close to me! Shit, looks like there's an electric lock. Okay, the wires go... Oh, over there. Hey, look, D'Artagnan. You've got the light. If you follow the wire, there should be a fuel box somewhere. Just the power to get the electric lock. That was cool. Genius. Good thinking. Ready? Okay. First up. Follow me. We're almost at the theater now. The metro entrance. Chuvak, we're here. Pull yourself together. We don't have long before nightfall, okay? 
Okay, with the tunnel collapsed, the only way to reach the escalator down to the other station is cross the surface. And trust me, we don't want to be caught out here in the fucking dark. Opa, we're in luck, Artyomich! This place seems lived in. Rangers probably, I don't know. And when there are rangers? Shit! Short on filters. We'll have to make do. Now come on, take what you need. We're all brothers in the metro. Hey, Prieti. I could use a good watch like yours. Knowing how much air you got left is a must, huh? You know, I've heard of things roaming around that even bullets can stop. You have been through some bad shit, I know, but not like what's coming. Artyom, remember, if you want to live, don't drop your guard for an instant, okay? I heard about this place. That plane was headed into Moscow when the whole city caught fire. Uh, the building where it crashed, that's the entrance to the theater. The ice is towing up here. It's almost like spring, Artyom. Huh? Maybe we'll live to see the summer. Wait, 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 wait. There's got to be an underground path going around. The ranger has never put a flare out in the open. Airline officer doesn't steal from horses, but you're fucking. Go ahead. Okay, Chubak, you're all covered with blood. Found a shotgun? Nice. That will come in handy. Artyom, stop! Get down, now! Watchman! You are a huge pack. The storm must be driving me. Stop! If they spot us, I smell trouble. That was close. Okay, Artyom, no more tricks like that. Let's get to the plane before another pack comes through. Move it! Uh, I've heard stories about this place. Weird shit happens here. Hey, try opening it. I'll give cover. Jumped? Oh, bleh, let's try together. Move it. Look, Artyom, don't. Lose your head in here, you understand me? Okay, let's go. One ranger told me this was a flight from Mallorca. Family is returning from vacation, you know? You know, Artyom, I've never been to the sea. 
I didn't want to play myself. Yeah, well, wasn't meant to be. I feel, I don't know, I feel weird. Chuck, are you seeing this shit too? Artyom, what is this? Shoo, my you! Look! They're alive! Probably have suffocated like the others did. Ooh, like this. <laughs> like this one. Yeah. Okay. 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 Let's get out of this place now. Now. Artyom, go right. I think we'll find the entrance behind the building. Shit! The demon! Take it down! Take it down! Блин, someday a creature like you will take me. Not yet, okay? Fucking watchman, as soon as we moved away from the plane and we were almost there, huh? Get ready. We're moving in from the second floor. Get to the escalator! 
Short visit to dead Moscow. Okay, come on in. Sorry about that. Dangerous times, right? We're going up soon. Are there many watchmen around? We were lucky to get here. Okay, there's a nest in the building by the wrecked plane. Yeah, no wonder it's such a bad view today. Oh, you want a nightmare? Well, it's waiting for you up there. No sense going with just three men. Artyomich, so, if it's culture you want, the Bolshoi is up there, above us. All the actors who survived are here. Well, people come from all over the metro to see the shows they put on. So what are they running from? Before each campaign, a lot of people in the Reich are accused of being mutants. Why? Well, if you enlist, they acknowledge you as a person. But anyone deemed unnecessary is chased off or hung. So you're here. Is it all of you, or are more coming? We're all here. Two trains, as agreed. Our people from the first one, did they get permission to enter? Still waiting. They're giving our chief hell, but there's nothing he can do about it. So, maybe while they're talking, you could let us in? No, we can't. Sorry, that's forbidden, without a permit. How about just the kids? And leave the parent here? No, you better just wait there. But you did let the first group in. No, they're sitting on their train at the transfer track. Be grateful you're on the platform where you have some space. Understood. Listen, everyone. Our stay permits are still being negotiated. How could this happen? So they told us to We've wait. been in the wreck all our lives, and now we're freaks? Ugh, this happens all the time. But why? Why to us? They keep raising the standards. Last time it was our neighbors. This time, it's us. Would be long before Führer has this station to himself. But what do we do now? Live! And be glad we won't have our skulls measured every day. Oh, I'm... I'm fainting. Hard to breathe. Calm down. Take a breath. Everything is alright. Everything is fine. She's having a breakdown. We spent 20 years at the Reich, and now we're freaks. Can't catch my breath. My heart's pounding. That's our plan. The station next to this one is Revolution Square. One of ours. Red. And Revolution is spitting distance to police. So, I, as a good communist, which I am, will vouch for you. They'll have to let you through. And you'll be home in no time. What do you think? Are you the one they just told us about? Yes, we are. Great. Come in then. So, my Spartan friend, have a look around. There's plenty to see here. Huh? I'll talk to my people and find you. Welcome. Have a good rest. But you do understand that we can't wait here forever. Bullets to the last surviving theatrical critic. Bullets for mercy on your souls. So, young men, I see you like my witty sign. There is a place for everyone in this underground. Murderers, whores, tyrants. Money changers, even peasants, for Christ's sake. All are welcome here. 
even lousy actors. I live in a theater where we breathe the miasma of the decaying Bolshoi. This station is overpopulated with the ghosts of the opera. But is there a place here for the best critic of our once great country? Hell no. I tell the truth. And I am repaid with insults and poverty? I say you are a disgrace to the name of Bolshoi. And they reply, now Bolshoi is us and us alone. They're immune to criticism. They choose money over art. And these poor souls traveling from all over Metro to see the glorious Bolshoi? They are played for fools. They say that art only interests the well-fed. But my young friend, I will argue that even the hungry need art. For thinking on exalted matters dulls the pain of an empty stomach. But sadly, true art is 20 years gone. What remains is profane trash. And so my own hunger persists. Will you honor what we've lost by perhaps donating a bullet? Ah, so there are still men, not just marionettes. I disgust myself. Here we sit, with drinks, and party lights, when all around us radiation, death, decay, and endless war. Death and decay. That's exactly why we need theater. A drink and a show warms your body and soul. Without that, I would make well end it all. Feast in the time of plague. So, when does our guest arrive? The masked one with the scythe. Any minute now. So drink up. Cheers. Is really yeah, Sonic. Is it so you? No? Why? What happened? Vitya didn't make it. How? We were heading back. A demon appeared. We all hit the ground and shot at the demon until it fled. No one suffered the scratch. But Vitya didn't get up. His mask, it had cracked open on a brick. And you, you left him there to die. No, Katya. We tried to save him, but it was too late. No, Vitya! We buried him in the wood place. We put white stones on the grave. Let her be. This is a demon? Well, it's... All right, let it be a demon. But there used to be birds like this. Birds? Are they mean like demons? No. They were beautiful. Some were big, but smaller than demons. Birds didn't attack people. They would wake you in the morning with their songs. Now, what animal is this one? Could it be Nosalis? The nose is too big, though. Surge, did your dad tell you about beasts like that? No. And he was everywhere. Even the library. Even the park. He saw a bear once. <gasps> is this a bear, Uncle Misha? It's an elephant. You saw them in the Were elephants scary? Could the Nosaluses be what's left of them? The elephants, oh, they were large. But they never attacked first. Only when they were provoked. But if they got mad, they could stomp you. That's just like a Nosalis. Dad says if a big Nosalis starts running, she stomps everything in their path. She'll even stomp her own kids. Well, they could be related. They had elephants at the zoo after all. Though they definitely are smaller now if they are the Nosalis. And what kind of bird is this? That's this one. Look at its long neck. I know that bird. To it was in the book. Tonight's and Mama has a picture of it with those numbers in the corner. Don't lose she your has chance. it hanging on the Give wall. A glitch, that is a swan. And why are you boys keeping silent? You saw the book and saw the calendar on Thomas? 
I thought it was some kind of mutant. Me too. It does look like the picture in the book, but this one was moving. Look, boys. Try imagining that there's still... Well... All right. Who is this? This is definitely spider bug. Look at its mandibles. Oh, isn't no, it its legs? No, it's a goat, just like on that picture. Are those it's horns poisoned? It's does it grab you with those? <gasps> does it hate light Mama too? says it butts you with these. I'm so afraid of goats. Goats are worse than spider bugs. They aren't afraid of light. You know, Katya, that really is a goat. But it's not scary at all. And it won't butt you for no reason. Anyway, it's a really useful animal. Their milk is so tasty. <laughs> Was. Uncle Misha, Kat is the only one who knows these strange animals. Show us something we know too, or it's not fair. Yeah, show something we know. All right, you recognize this one. Who's first? Me, me. It's the a legend of the metro. Look at it Tonight snap its jaws. It's gonna jump out of its hole. That's a leaper for sure. Sorry, children. I used to know how to show those animals, but I got old. Let me take a rest, and I'll try again later. I'll try to recall Don't how to show you, so that you'll understand. My papa is a stalker. He'll get me one of those dogs. My dad is a pilot. He'll get me a hundred. Well, mine said he'd get it tomorrow. Mom says when he comes back, if I behave. But he's not coming back until later. Ah, oh, so it's not going to be soon? Let's go to Natasha's then and play with her doll for now. Let's go! and gain instant respect. This is one respectable item. Well, this is great plans. stuff. The Pro best you'll find. Silent I don't know, it's prohibited. Maybe I'll just get a drink instead. You can drink anywhere. This is a theater. Anything goes. But hey, I won't twist your arm. Just don't come back in 10 minutes when you change your mind. It all begun. Wait a minute, I gotta think. Think faster. Look, there's another tourist there. If you don't buy this, he's sure to. All right, all right, I'm taking it. Yeah, thanks, man. If not for you, I'd never get this sucker to buy. If you want some for yourself, come back in the evening. I'm waiting for a new supply. Come back later. This shit will knock you out. Bullets, bullets, purchase, exchange, sale. How can you 
Well, Artyom, I made all the arrangements. We can go to the revolution now. They will let us in through the theater. We've seen on the revenge at the platform hiding from his wife. I just can't hit a woman. You are an entirely different. Hey, you! Stop! Show me your tickets! Did you hear? Oh, <laughs> sure. Come in. Burning with the desire to keep the faith. Well, Stanislavski, you can watch the show if you like. I'll wait for you at the dressing room. Maestro, if you'd be so kind. The can can. this before I feel sorry for the other performance now their attempts at impressing the audience might fall short after such a spectacle but <laughs> I trust they will handle the race far of our expectations and thus our incredible show continues this man spits in the eye of danger challenges nature defies the God of his new world and proof once again that humanity is a master of all. A warm welcome for Leonid Burley, our animal trainer extraordinaire, with his, uh, terror of our city. <laughs> over the mutants. Speaking of mutants, even our station has heard the rumors of new species that were encountered at exhibition. Fearsome beasts, black as midnight, invincible, able to induce madness in anyone who saw them. But even those were no match for human ingenuity. The guys at exhibition had noticed they were brewing the wrong mushrooms. When they went back to the traditional recipe, the new mutants were gone like morning dew. <laughs> Let us cheer for the heroes at exhibition! And tonight's show goes on. It is time to bring a lyrical mood to our show. We give you the genius of chamber music. The famous accordion player, Kolya Pajarny, with his masterpiece, My Heart Reaches for the Sky, but hits the ceiling and falls down the bottle. A round of applause, please.
you, Goya. The harp of my soul will never sound the same. Your music is such strings with so much power. And thus, our incredible show continues. Today, I have the honor of presenting to you the hottest, the most explosive act this side of Atlantic Ocean. The most scorching spectacle of today. Our fire show! A round of applause to welcome the performers. Please! Please! Completely mind-blowing, incredible, simply incredible. If a tiny bit too hot, just a couple of degrees higher, and I'd be charred. <laughs> thank you, dear friends, thank you. But I must say that however hot that was, the girls were a bit hotter still. <laughs> Guys, you've got to answer the challenge. Try using the flamethrower, perhaps. <laughs> And yet, we have more, dear audience. Please welcome the Arpeggio Virtuoso, the God of Legato, and Demon of Tremolo, the favorite student of Mel Bay and Vladimir Manilov, the premier guitarist of the New Age, Victor Minchuk with his fantasies. Please welcome our Virtuoso. <laughs> Ignite, my legs would start dancing, and my soul would go straight to wherever it's heading to. Thank you, Victor. Ladies and gentlemen, I must announce a change in today's program. To our sincere regret, our visiting magician ran out of ladies for his sawmill act. <laughs> but never fear, we have filled the gap with greatness. Your complete attention, please, as I present the birth of a legend. The Minchuk and Pajarni duet with their instrumental impromptu, the Song of Songs. A round of applause to cheer our great musicians on. <laughs>
Yes! That definitely was the musical innovation of the century! Incredible! Completely incredible! My left ear is still ringing. <laughs> You've just heard the virtuosos of the Mosca underground. The duo known as Minchuk and Pozarny. Our dear audience. This sad moment always come, no matter how often we wish you would not. But our show for today is over. I hope you've enjoyed it as much as we have enjoyed your company. Thank you, and please come again. Maestro, give us something emotional. Goodbye. Farewell. Parting is such sweet Artyom, no? Enjoy the show? Sorry, man. Time to move on, you patron of the art. Oh, Pavel Igorovich. So glad to see you. Where have you been? You don't like us anymore? Helen, no, sto, I'm, I'm totally in love with you girls, but I've been busy with work. I'm, I'm very, very sorry. I'll come back soon. I promise. Yeah, to you, you Google. Jana, let me use your powder. In your dreams, you have your own. Use that. It's no good. Why can't your boyfriend buy you something better? Her boyfriend is cheap, that's why. No, he's reliable and doesn't waste his money. In that case, you should just marry him. He won't propose. He's too cheap for that, too. Fool. We're just testing our love. Dead, yeah. And in the meantime, he made you some powder by scratching the ceiling. At least I have a man of my own, instead of selling myself at the bar. You'd do it, too, if anyone would buy. Girls, enough quarreling. The prompt bell's going to go off soon. So what? I'm not going on stage with her. You better. You've nowhere else to go since the freak show left the station. You bitch! Knock it off! No fighting here! More on stage! Okay, let's let it go. No, it's not okay! What? Should I call Petrovna? No, please don't. Then finish your makeup. It's our call soon. Refugees again. More refugees. What's going on? What else? Another war. Looks like the fucking Kongs are going to fight the Reich again. Shit. Is war all they know? Instead of wasting ammo on each other, they could be wiping out the vermin. They don't give a shit about that. The Nosalis has butchered my father. Who cares? No one. So how are we supposed to live? Or raise our children? If the monsters don't kill them, other men will. This is what I'm saying. Why go on day after day? Why can't it just end? Anyways, I tell you, we should be going, but uh, let's drink to the fact we are still alive. Huh? It's on me, okay? Here you are. Do over a special from the old stock. Been infusing it for half a year. Opa! That's great! So, let's drink, Artyom! Smooth stuff, huh? And this is a good place, but yeah, home is the best, you know? You know, I've traveled all over the metro and people talk all kinds of shit about the red line. That it's awful there, there's no food, that we shoot comrades for nothing, and you can't even tell a joke without getting arrested. Wait, let's have another drink. Here goes, Artyom! Wow. So, <clears throat> yes, our life is a bit strict. One party, one leader, one ideology, but we have order. And everything is shared. Food, medicine, fuel, shelter. No rich men, true. But no beggars either. Another drink. And now, to equality. Come on, Artyom. No, 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 no. Pay that now. Ooh, хорошо прошла. Ah, where was I? Ah, uh, yes. 
Yes, look, look at the far stations. They're freaking eat each other, sell their kids as slaves. It's like the Stone Age. Left his own devices, a man becomes a beast. You know, war there, war there is all that matters. That's that's our salvation. So you can believe whatever, but I am red. I am red until the day I die. I drink to order, Vlin. Come on, Artyom, come on! Bottoms up! Bottoms up! So, my friend, that's how it goes. Don't be mad, Artyom. Just doing my job to protect the red line. And you, Musketeer, are from the wrong side of the barricade. Private, take this comrade in. Yes, Major, sir. Yes, sir. It is private. That was so Move it! Hey, stop that, blad! It's just being over enthusiastic, you know? Artyom, look, I think of you as my friend, really. But as a soldier, you understand that I had to follow my orders and bring you here, okay? Now you're under arrest, but perhaps it's not the end of the line for you. I hope. Good day, sir. Good day, sir. At ease, товарищ. So, you're doing good here? Are you not? Yes, sir. Comrade Moskvin is here, inspecting the troops. The Secretary General here? What about Comrade Korb? Yes, sir. Comrade General is here, too. Oppa, it's my lucky day, huh? Okay, things are moving faster than we anticipated. Look, Artyom, you're a smart guy, so you understand there is no such thing as coincidence. You are here because we need you. information. So, my advice to you, my friend? Cooperate. Okay? But don't worry, I got your back. Because we are what? Musketeers! All for one, and one for all. But your comrades in the order, their motto is all for us. War is coming, my friend. That bunker you guys found, whoever controls it survives and fuck the rest of us. But we have been preparing for this. And I want you to join us. That's all. Comrade General! Comrade Morozov, I was beginning to think you had not survived your mission. I was captured, Comrade Corbett. This stranger here, uh, saved me. What a coincidence! He's Nitsky, one of the Spartan Rangers. Do you know this man? Yes, sir. His name is Artyom. Miller trusts him. They found the six together. He's also earned several commendations since officially enlisting with the Order. Well, I am overjoyed to meet you, Comrade Artyom. I think we both have something to offer. Take the... Comrade to the negotiation room. Young man, let's dispense with the introductory probing and cutting the chase. Hmm? This telepathic mutant, the so-called Dark One, is of extreme scientific significance. Tell me all you know about it, and I will allow you to keep your life and your job with the Rangers. <laughs> but, as my spy, an operative, just like those uh, musketeers. One for all, and all for... Secretary General Comrade Moskvin. Corbut, I need a moment. And what do we have here? Another enemy of the revolution? <laughs> Perfect. As you have always noted, Lunium must start learning how to improve his, uh, people skills. As a matter of fact, we were... Ah, put away your truth serums. I'll show you a more traditional Red Army method. Faster and more effective. You shit! Spill your guts now! Tell everything you know of these six! <laughs> Oh, fuck! 
still nothing, huh? <laughs> okay, cat, bitch! You talk, or I'll fry your balls in pig fat! Passwords, code names, operation protocols! What are you doing, Dad? This is called interrogation, Lonya. Interrogation. Business as usual. What? You never did that playing dolls? No! You little shit! There's no power without blood! There is! Your brother ruled peacefully, and they still love him! Get back here! You're a thug. God damn it! Butcher. All right. Use your drugs. Use hot pokers. Just get everything out of him and shoot the bastards. And then come to my office. We must talk. Come back here! You may be my friend. Oh, I must agree with Leonid. Brutality is a crooked path to information. I believe in science. One injection and you will tell us everything. I need you to go to Venice and take care of the locals who made the delivery. This will not be a cash payment. Understand? Completely, sir. And uh, what about the dark one? The creature has been located. The details are in this envelope. You will pick up the animal right after you go to Venice. Don't disappoint me this time. I won't, Comrade General. I, uh, I won't. Fuck Corbett! Fuck my father! And Morozov! And the revolution and my own future! I'd rather be shot and end up like father, killing his own brother! Listen, if you get out of here, just, well, just live! Here! Get in there! This is the way to freedom! Believe me, I know! Well, good luck to you! Sit down, Corbett. Let's talk. About the negotiations in Polis? Ah, so you already know. I am the head of intelligence, after all. Then why did you let the information leak? Damned refugees. Polis, Hansa, and even the fucking Nazis already know about our plans. The rats will be exterminated. And war is inevitable anyway. Inevitable? I have my doubts. So does the Politburo. A doubtful man is a fearful man. How dare you! You're the head of state security, and you report to me! Yes, but now, when we are one step away from a unified Red Metro, you have no right to disrupt the plan. I have no right? I'm... Moscovin. When you asked me how to deal with your elder brother when he was still the Secretary General, I helped you. And after his tragic death, I bucked your takeover. So I suggest you take my advice again. This is unacceptable. It's very simple, Comrade Moskvin. We all stand together, arms linked against the wind. Or it's every man for himself. But, Corbett, is this whole fucking metro truly worth the blood we're going to spill? I have a way of doing it without spilling any blood. No blood, you say? All right. Go do your trick. I'll handle the police bureau. Frontal assault is hopeless, but if we go underground to the church, advance through the catacombs, then attack the... <laughs> now I am in a real spider-infested catacombs, where the General Secretary Moskvin does not look like the head spider.
Quit shaking. The manual says it's the red wire. So that's the one you cut. You cut it yourself. I'll go stand there around the corner. Piss your pants already? <laughs> then watch a real man. Well, if you're a real man, why are your hands shaking? Hands don't mean shit. The important thing is nothing else shakes. Okay. Composed. Composed. Oh, the red wire. The red wire. <laughs> your minds already. First you order a patrol, then you expect me to sit here. Second post. Come in. Second post. What the hell? What am I supposed to do? Split in two? Second post here. Second post. Report your situation. Reporting. Group 8 left the facility using Tunnel 2. the premises me alone come on get to work all of you yes sir i will say did you take care of the rats i want them all burnt commander we're not nazis shooting is one thing but we can't burn people alive what do you mean people shooting are you out of it aren't you talking about the refugees what refugees let the special department handle them i'm talking real rats tails and all they multiply like crazy so you go and do it on the door. Yes, sir. Sign you all some Wasn't expecting that. <laughs> what happened, Andrei? Construction's in a crunch mode. They're short on hands, so they're putting us on this. Huh. I see. Well, since you do, go on and give those two idlers something to do. Yes, sir. Find something to do yourself, too. They're determined to make us work. Let's find some stuff to do. Quick. All right, I'll go move some boxes. Right. right. Let Great. them come here if I they want anything. Here to well, let them fix that. Make shit. it look good and we'll keep them up our ass. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
personnel. What the hell did they want? Probably the usual shit about safety precautions. As if we didn't sign in the book. We did, so what good is that? One asshole got run over by a crane last week. No, he lost an eye when the cable broke. That was last month. I'm talking last week. Oh, now I understand why they're going on about safety like that. That's my life. Who's gonna work if everyone is out of commission? Well, yes. I wish they fixed that dumb radio or something. Makes me unhappy, you know? To the hospital. Mark my words. It's the only thing that kept me alive. But what the hell happened? Why? You don't know about the bridge? Sure, I know the place. I served there for a short.
Something seems off here. Hmm. What? I have to cut down the drinking. And everything else, I guess. Hey you, down there! Watch out for your head! What the hell? More radioactive trash. We got the shit already stored to capacity. These keeps up will be glowing like stalkers. Shut up, it's our job. Just be happy they don't make you collect this crap on the surface. Okay. Are we going to do any more for you today? Well, that was the last one. Good. I'm taking a small break. Don't take too long. You know what happens to those who fail to turn up at roll call? Besides, who's scared of them fucking rangers, huh? <laughs> I wish there was one of those around. Fuck, it scared me, huh? <laughs> those rooms will take the edge off. Yeah, I'm ready. Okay, let's handle this one. Heat exchange of temperature. Well, how long do I have to Normal. fucking stand here? Normal. Methanol Pissing output at the separator. All right. Synthesis gas pressure. Nominal. Compressor speed. Okay, Lata. Catalyst state. Standard. Flow rate. A okay. Great, got that. To the third!
decide. Who's scared of the fucking rain, huh? <laughs> I wish there was one of those around. Did you accept the delivery and sign the manifest? I sure did. Where did you put the goods? Wherever I had space left. Top shelves, mostly. Can you be more specific? Specific? Wherever I left the ladder. There's our goods. My shift's nearly over. Best of the other guy when he arrives. All right, all right. I'll go and check if everything's still there. Mm-hmm. 
Who's there? I hear some gold daggers. to stand here much longer. Nah. We should be coming back from the rough soon. Did you ever do watch duty there? Yeah, it's a creepy place. The station's nearby. There's the machine gun, the searchlight, your comrades are around. And something rustles in the cobwebs in the sound it just freezes blood. Why not burn those webs? We do that all the time. In a couple of weeks, the damn beast have everything covered with that shit again. Damn. They sure are a lot of trouble. Maybe we should just weld the gate shut and be done with it. And what if we have to get to Venice fast? How will we go there? Take a train to Hansa territory? Forget it. The only way is to keep that damn watch there. happening after a six-hour watch. Maybe, but somebody is stealing the parts of food. Probably one of ours. Waiting till our backs are turned, then selling shit to Hansa. Either way, the brass better not hear you talking. If you say too much, they'll pin it on you. So the Stay down, or your brain goes splat! Wait a minute. Artyom, is it you? I was able to send the report back to the Order via my... That's one serious pickle you're in. But I can help. I have friends, and they have friends, who can relay everything you tell me to your guys from the Order. So, now you must return home to Polis? Well, there's no direct route. Everything's cordoned off here. But I believe the Order has an outpost nearby. On the surface, the church and the marshes. Try that place. If we can get word to your people, they might meet you there. As for me, I started life anew. Left Kuznetsky most. The Reds completely subverted the place. 
looking for traitors and spies, sending people to camps, or just shooting them, all because of the coming war. People are fleeing from Kuznetsky Most and their whole red line. Did you see the armored train the Reds are building? Well, we built something too, with the stuff the refugees are bringing. Here, take a look. At this baby, the boys even gave her a name. You can't help but fall in love with her. She did a swell job running refugees, but hell, you can't save everyone. So, take it. We have people in Venice, too. When you get there, find Woodpecker and tell him where you left our baby. Climb aboard! All right, start the engine. We're still tinkering with her, so the controls aren't perfect. But the lights are first class. No need to fear the spider bugs around her. And there's a lot of those in the far tunnels. You should go. It's a long way, so you shouldn't waste any time.
Pavel's group is advancing towards Tretikovskaya, also known as Venice. They have a few hours lead on me and are moving via frequently used tunnels. But I will catch up. I can't afford not to. Stand still or we shoot! We're armed! We are armed! Swear by Lenin's name! <laughs> he doesn't look like a GB. I don't recognize the uniform. Could he be one of ours? Look at all his weapons. Don't shoot! We are civilians! There are women and children here! Leave and let leave, okay? We're refugees from the Red Line. I'm in charge here, basically. No, there's nobody under my command. All the battle-worthy men went with the other caravan. Half a click ahead. I thought they'd protect us, but they were attacked. We heard the shooting. It subsided. But it doesn't look like our people survived. So we can't go any further. And if we go back, it's the firing spot for us. You look like you've seen your share of fights. Can you help us? It's not for me, but I pity the children. So what do we do now? How do we live without them? They might still be alive. Don't bury them yet. 
but the shooting. The shooting was so loud. And now there is nothing. And what if they won? Why? Why don't they come for us then? They might come soon. Let's just wait. Do you think they... They killed them all? They could have. Or it could be worse. How? Women were with them. Yasha, if ignorance is bliss, you're the happiest guy around. So are we going to help our guys or what? What help can just the two of us be? If they're hidden down, we could flank the bandits. Let's get ready then. Well, you're not going anywhere. Who's going to protect the women and children? But we can't let the bandits butcher our guys. That stranger is going to help us. Looks like he's worth 20 of you anyway. You are an idiot to believe you're Andre the blacksmith. Oh, it's safe. You'll get there in no time. And you dragged me here. And now we're all gonna die because of your stupid blacksmith. Shut your mouth. Andre's a saint. He got us all out and lots of people before us. Yeah, he got us out just to be robbed by bandits. And how the hell was he supposed to know about the bandits? Then he shouldn't tell people it's safe. Such bullshit. How about the GB? He did save us from them. And what difference does it make if we're still going to be killed by bandits? Dumb woman! <laughs> I don't even want to look at you. You tell me, Yasha. What made you flee? Mobilization, of course. A boy your age has no business with a rifle. They always overlooked me. But then, I was summoned to duty. Mom said with my luck, <laughs> I'd bite the dust the second I hit the front lines. So, she got me into this caravan. Which seems like a mistake now. You're still young. You'll find a place for yourself if we get anywhere. But me, I served them for 20 years. 20! They gave me a pension. A hundred grams of mushrooms and a bullet a day. And they don't let me beg, saying it's a disgrace to the motherland. So, I choose treason over hunger. Though, who'd ever need me? So I left, because the war is approaching, and our station's right in the way. During the last war, the people ran, but there was a rifle squad of our own soldiers at the rear. Men, to not let the panic spread. So I learned the lesson and ran before it started. And here we are, stuck. Yes, you guys at the edge stations have it tough. Not that we're better off. My husband got drafted, so I waited for him. Then one of his squad mates came over. I thought, that's it. He's dead. But no, he was captured by the Nazis. That means his family goes to the camp. If you surrender, you're a traitor. Dad's no traitor. He's a hero. A hero. Real hero. Of course. <laughs> Come on, just take a look. Maybe you'll find something to add to your arsenal. If you need a weapon, come back. I'm not going anywhere yet. You're trying to take too much. Bye! Oh, 
Looks like there's... The shooting was so loud, and now there is nothing. And what if they won? Why? Why didn't they come for us then? They might come soon. Let's just wait. Do you think they... they killed them all? They could have. Or it could be worse. How? Women were with them. Yasha, if ignorance is bliss, you're the happiest guy around. So are we going to help our guys or what? What help can just the two of us be? If they're pinned down, we could flank the bandits. Let's get ready then. Well, you're not going anywhere. Who's going to protect the women and children? But we can't let the bandits butcher our guys. That stranger is going to help us. Looks like he's worth 20 of you anyway. You were an idiot to believe you're Andre the Blacksmith. Oh, it's safe. You'll get there in no time. And you dragged me here. And now we're all gonna die because of your stupid blacksmith. Shut your mouth. Andre's is safe. He got us all out and lots of people before us. Yeah, he got us out just to be robbed by bandits. And how the hell was he supposed to know about the bandits? Then he shouldn't tell people it's safe. Such bullshit. How about the GV? He did save us from them. And what difference does it make if we're still going to be killed by bandits? Dumb woman. <laughs> I don't even want to look at you. You tell me, Yasha. What made you flee? Mobilization, of course. A boy your age has no business with their rifle. They always overlook me. But then, I was summoned to duty. Mom said with my luck, <laughs> I'd bite the dust the second I hit the front lines. So, she got me into this caravan. Which seems like a mistake now. You're still young. You'll find a place for yourself if we get anywhere. But me, I served them for 20 years. 20! They gave me a pension. A hundred grams of mushrooms and a bullet a day. And they don't let me beg saying it's a disgrace to the motherland. So, I choose treason over hunger. Though, who'd ever need me? So I left, because the war is approaching, and our station's right in the way. During the last war, the people ran, but there was a rifle squad of our own soldiers at the rear. They just shot everyone. Women, children, old men. To not let the panic spread. So I learned a lesson and ran before it started. And here we are, stuck 
Yes, you guys at the edge stations have it tough. Not that we're better off. My husband got drafted, so I waited for him. Then one of his squad mates came over. I thought, that's it. He's dead. But no, he was captured by the Nazis. That means his family goes to the camp. If you surrender, you're a traitor. Dad's no traitor. He's a hero. A hero. Real hero. Of course. <laughs> Come, I'll sell really cheap. I'm in no position here to charge more than minimum. Come here, friend. I'm you from can't the smoke, carry that so much. I have some weapons. Bye. Come on, just take a look. Maybe you'll find something to add to your arsenal. Come back. I'm not going anywhere yet. We searched everything already. They had a lot of shit here. Might have missed some bullets or whatever. Well, move your ass. The other guys are probably back home already half drunk.
Hey, I'm gonna go check on the men. They're taking too fucking long. Man, untie me now. Thanks, thanks, man. I thought, I thought I was done for. It took everyone still alive, the kids, the women. I'll move the rail car so that you can drive through. If you follow them, be careful in the technical tunnel. I heard the bandits talk about the trap there. Come again if you need anything.
look. If some shit happens, put me in the pocket. What the hell? Whose wheels are these? Fellas, we got company here. Just a few more bullets left. What? what? Huh?
down on drinking. Well, how long do I have to fucking stand here? I am fucking fed up. some sleep. <sighs> Shit, I wish I had some food here. It's not as scary when you have some food. The boss said if we let just one snitch slip by, he's gonna have our ass. No sheep. Let's go.
Boom. We're going to find this fuck. Not here. Some deep shit, bro. Well, take care. I'll go check on the guys. All right, bro. Well, real shit goes on in that time. There were five of us that died. All on the line. No matter what we done, we started to fall dead. But this is a black star. You fucking believe it? So we enter it and flash. All the fucking lights go on. So what the fuck is that? And the guy said, we're okay, but the voices didn't sound like them. I'm telling them, let's go back. And they say, no, no, we're good here, it's okay. Then I remembered my lighter, so I flick it open, and I see them just sitting there, mouths open, that black shit seeping in and out of them. My friend Yorka starts screaming and he swats the lighter out of my hand. So I ran my gal back to the stations and over the hole. Alarm! The Enemies here! That's intense! Hey, you hear the one about the tunnel master? No. some deep shit, bro. Well, take care. I'll go check on the guys. All right, bro. 
screaming and he swats the lighter out of my hand. So I ran my girl back to the stations and nobody heard of them again. Fuck! That's intense! Hey, you hear the one about the tunnel master? No. Yeah, you know at the end stations of all the lines, where the tunnel terminates and guys make a fire drink with the guards.
surface starts melting. The familiar rail cars are now joined with boats and fishermen. One of them appeared just in the nick of time. Soon we'll be docked at Venice. Pavel is most probably already there. in this tunnel, but I had a hunch they'd be biting pretty good here. Thought you'd figure it out by yourself.
Wow, this doesn't happen often. Looks like we lucked out. The subterranean Venice, an island on the dark waters of Africa. Wow. Oh, seems like we made it. Hey, are you asleep there? What do you think of the local fish, huh? Aren't they charming? Mm, seem moody, though. Looks like somebody went through there before us and angered them. Open up! The fishermen are back from the seas! Yeah, I see you, all right. And who might that be? I picked the guy up in the tunnel. You don't think I should have left him there, do you? What? And make my life easy? Of course not. First is red, now this with this one. And I keep raising a lower the gate. You can bring a girl for once. And what would you do with one if I brought her, Semenovich, huh? You're way too old for that stuff. By the way, you better lower the gate, or else a woman might actually come. The one dressed in black and bearing a scythe. <laughs> Never fear. Semenovich is going to outlive you all. Hey, Fidor, how's fishing? Uh, not even a bite, unless you count the shrimps. And they got a few more out of me than I'd like. I was saved by this lad, Artyom. Nice to meet you, Artyom. Thanks for your help. So what exactly did happen? The shrimps were all over us as soon as we got to the fork. Almost took my raft apart. Uh, what the hell gives? Uh, I wonder. Oh, that's easy. The Reds passed through here, going to meet our esteemed neighbors. Didn't seem to care what they stirred up. Ah, so that's why. Look, Artyom, I suppose there is no hiding. Venice is full of gangsters. Julek, the scum of the earth. So don't you start any shit. I don't want any trouble. Simon, hey, Simon, I want to talk to you. Look, do you know where might our red guests be? In the brothel, of course. Who's that with you? This is Artyom, the scourge of the shrimps. <laughs> you should see him shoot. <laughs> I never met anyone quite as good as him. A gunslinger, eh? Would you help me take out a few bad guys? Simon, I freaking knew it. This is getting old. But almost all of them are gathered at the storage facility. Look, if this isn't the right time, I don't know what is. Between the two of us, we might be able to take them out. I told you countless times already, and I'm going to tell you again. No! I don't need the shit around here. Do you get me? Yeah, I got you. Right. Then I'm going to leave you two. Okay. An station of criminals. How is it he's in charge? Hey, Simon. You're good with engines, aren't you? Yeah, what's up? I uh, don't know. It was all right yesterday, now it's all coughing and spitting smoke. Ignition, perhaps? Well, let's take a look. I don't even know what to think. Well, just keep trying, will you? Sure, I'm not going anywhere. Oh, 
Here's your drink. No need. What did I say? Out! All right, all right. <laughs> Good stuff, Anthony. Yes, How sure. about some boo? What's taking you so long? <laughs> are simple. You take position and kill all the critters. If you make it before the signal, you can collect your winnings. Be my guest. And here are the stinky grenades. Come on, get yourself some. I bet he's not hitting anything. Nice shot. He's not Two to one. If he hits everything. I'm even all right with three. Great! Right. Here's your winning. It's a deal. How about the race? Mines! They should go back and bang. I take Come on in. Myself. Take position. Oh, that's something. He actually hit. Ah, anyone can get lucky. Really? That's what he go for. Him. See that? He hit again. I have all kinds of guns for sale. Great! Here's your winning. How about Red the race? Great prices today. The He's targets are waiting. Get the fire started. <laughs> hey you! Why are you supposed to like that? Looks like you might be in for three bottles. No oh, way! Here. He's missing the one. What is that? Now? Hit again? That was something. Here's a special prize for you. The targets usually last till the evening. Well, our barbecue is going to be busy for a while now. All right, it's okay. All right, hush, baby, hush. What happened? I lost my teddy bear. Hush, baby. My teddy bear! Mom, the teddy bear is back! Where have you been? Were the buttons good? Don't leave me again! Oh, thank you so much! I was at a loss! What should you say? This person helped your teddy bear come home, so what should you say? Thank you. Thank you, you're a godsend. Simon the teddy bear... I have some really kick-ass guns here. Fresh inventory. So the system work outside this? You might Another be one. asking such questions. The bullets bounce right off. Off its armor. You're welcome. Oh, He's inside its mouth. Oh, How about some say? Hell, ask your guys to make me a vest out of that. I'll give you some salt and some damn good pop. Try it. Be my guest. As soon as it dries, it gets brittle like glass. Another one. Here you are. Some music. Come on, come on. Everything trashed. Everything. The boss is gonna kill me now. God, what do I 
do? Where do I get the new furniture, huh? Furniture? What the hell do you want here, you asshole? Didn't have enough? Look at what you and your... Thank you! Thank you so much! I don't even know what to say! But you're always welcome here! Sure. We don't have bosses here. Cough it up. Are you crazy? They're threatening to kiss me. That's what I want. I have sure? some really kick ass guns here. Fresh inventory. Special menu prices. Huge discounts. Freshest meat around. Come on. Go. Nice bullets these are. Never had a problem with them. Real well, guns for real guns. All right, we had some fun. Now it's time for work. So, first thing, we pay Kinsley and you head it to Comrade Corbett. Tell him the virus container's been successfully delivered to Oktyabrska, okay? Hey, pretty boy. Let's Why go. are you just standing up? Business to attend. <coughs> hey, why is it so unhappy? Because Tom Spears is basically signed our death warrant. <coughs> Can't wait to touch me, can you, Daragoy? Well, if you want it that bad... What kind of dance would you like, sweetie? Uh, Tell me, don't be shy. I'm quite imaginative. Make yourself comfy, sweetie. So how do you like the dance, Daragoy? I see you liked it pretty much. Thank you. 
peaceful than the others. What do you mean? So, did you take a look around? I have some business with you. Let's be frank. It seems like you're stuck here for good. Sunk in tunnels everywhere. And if you go to Novokuznetskaya, you're as good as dead, probably. Seems like you're out of options. So, here's the deal. You could just stay here with us. You're young, tough, you can handle things, and we'll find you a job in no time. Especially since most of those newcomers here are just human refuse from Novokuznetska. Just think about it. You start working with our fishermen, get a bit acquainted with things, then you might actually like it here. We could even find you a nice girl. Well, I won't pressure you. Go get some rest for now, and try to stay out of trouble. The gangsters seem to be jumpy today. You see that guy in the helmet? He gave us a case last time he was here, and Keithley sent it off to Octyorskaya. He said he was holding flyers for the working people. Flyers, my ass! That case had a lock. So, what was in there? I wish I knew. <laughs> I'd kill for a drink now. Shit, I'd kill for half a drink. <laughs> Well, once, me and the boys were having a drink. Well, 
shit about the filter? Just a regular gas mask filter. The mash they have here, it fucking stinks. But the filter takes care of that all right. That's bullshit. No need to spoil a good filter and make the guys wait longer. Yeah! What do you mean, cool? How do you we get good? Hi? Cool? <coughs> we got a deal. Besides, who needs your fire? We got them to the guy and went right back. I heard a street show came to a camp today. Is that right? Yeah. That's true. I have a new street. Well, small, black things, nothing but bones and eyes. That feeling in your belly that if you don't stop looking at it, you'll stop that. I think you actually mind. That's the main attraction. Quarter of the night or something. Small little creature, but when it starts to fall, you need to be Okay, so I have some new business for you. I need that beast. Alive. That's why they use it. Double dead and we're hmm? talking. Alright, you got it. But you have to be quick. That's what I was just like. You never heard of it. The beast is yours along with whatever mess he makes. <laughs> hey, uh, how about a glass of tea? Just got the new batch to spill. A little drink before you go? Alright, just a little. Drop your weapon, Juliet. Hands behind your head. Well, 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 what an unexpected encounter. Looking for the Dark One? Huh? Well, maybe there is a hope for you and Polis. But then, um, you're too late. Yeah, those Dark Ones of yours are the real deal, yeah? Comrade Corbett had an eye on them for a long time. Just imagine them domesticated, then unleashed on the enemy. <laughs> Hey, 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 steady, steady, steady now. All right, all right, you're on top, D'Artagnan, you are on top. What now? Uh, you were looking for the Dark One, right? Well, he is nearby, at Oktyabrskaya. I can take you there. No tricks this time, you have my word. Everyone on the ground, now! Artyom? No! Shit, he got away. The storage alone. You could have tried to call me. No, you worked out. But you'll have to get out of here on the double. I know an exit to the surface here. There's a swamp, but it's traversable. Let's go. Put this on. That's for the gangsters. If I'm lucky... Our people will be waiting for me at the outpost in the abandoned church. I will tell them everything I know. About Pavel. About a test of some kind they're going to conduct. And will continue my way to Oktobraskaya. The Dark One is there.
Here it is, the swamp. The base is right across in the church. You can't see it from here. There's a powered winch ferry. It needs fuel. You should be able to get some in the plane or in the cache at the gas station. Stay out of water if you want to live. Well, that's all. Good luck, Artyom.
I made quite a lot of noise pushing through the marshes. If there really are our people in the church, I will soon meet them.
Come on, move it! See you. Get inside. It's safe in there. Come on in. Come on, get inside. Don't waste your I had you sighted when you were way out there. Almost shot you too. <laughs> that would teach you to answer radio hails. But I well, I felt it was you. I hope you'll forgive me for the gardens. For some reason, I was genuinely glad to see Anna, my pain in the ass partner. I didn't take you seriously before, but Hunter, he read you right from the start. He put his trust in you. It took me time. I didn't understand until I saw you in action, and I almost got you killed. <laughs> you don't make this easy for me, Artyom. I'll stop for now. Go on and get ready. The guys are coming soon and we're all going to Aktiabriskaya. By the way, a traveling gun merchant stopped here for the night, so you could take a look at his merchandise. That's a great idea, girly. Help an old man survive these troubled times. Buy some so, guns. what's going on? Stock our team Mines on don't care if it's Should mutant or man. India. Takes anything down, just Thanks. like this. Look, you got nowhere to put this. If you need ammo or anything else, come again. Sanya, what's new in the air? How's the international <laughs> situation? It's incredible. For ten years, nothing but static. Then, last month, I got to St. Petersburg. And they know of us. Have Somebody you ever been to the catacombs? Mm -hmm. we a little one. Really old church catacombs. No idea how old, old they could be. Was. What do you they hear from New York and London, huh? <laughs> Some people from the church I hid here during the war, but... But there's they the just, city up north. They just disappeared. Oh, yeah, could have gone to the... By the way, a traveling gun merchant stopped here for the night, so you could take a look at his merchandise. That's a great idea, girly. Help an old man survive these troubled times. So, Buy some what's guns. going on? 
Stalker team is on the move. Should be here within the hour. Great. Sanya, what's new in the air? How's the international <laughs> situation? It's incredible. For ten years. Look, you got nowhere to put this. I'm staying then till tomorrow. Month, so if you need Have you ever been to the catacombs? Only once. Really old church catacombs. No idea how old they could be. They even survived the nuclear bombs. Some people from the church hid here during the war, but they just they just disappeared. Could have gone to the main metro tunnels or well people say things, you know? You mean the big mama? Who might that be? Well, our guys are fast. Check it out. Just in case. Password! Rod Block! That's an old one. I know that voice. Shit. I can't place it. Wait a minute. Could it be Lesnitsky? Ah! Anna, what a surprise. I'm no traitor. I never served you in the first place. We'll take this one back. No! That's it. Move!
roads lead to Octabraskaya. The Dark One is there. Anna is there now too. In the hands of my enemies. The hands of the traitor. Lesnitsky. Negotiating with the order. Just make sure she wears a gas mask. If she's infected, she's dead and of no use to us. So what do we do with her? Log her up and keep an eye on her. Anything happens, it's your head. I'll come get her when we're done here. for so so listen the reds they knew of the infection they came on the second day no one had died yet but they came with the flamers how else could they have known go tell everyone tell it it was the reds Yapping soldier. We're short of people for the unloading operation, so go and get those two on the double. They have to be at the storage in two minutes. Go! Yes, sir.
in the head. Oh, shit. It hurts like a bitch. I feel like hell. What do we have here? Behind. 
Somebody's got in his pockets. No bullets. Ah, shit. Hey, what the? <laughs> they all seem poor as church rats. Oh, that's something, all right. Well, at least that's what they can do. Oh, there. Shit. Either my ears gone bad or someone's out. Hmm. Somebody definitely did move here. Too many shrooms after all. <sighs> Shit. Sleep deprivation does play its tricks. That's one spooky place. <laughs> Firing squad. Time to get back to work, eh? Fleet deprivation does play its tricks. Shit! Talk about bad luck. Nobody's got in his pocket. No bullets. Huh? They all seem poor as church rats. Hey, hey what the? It looks like there's some kind of noise. Hmm. Uh, it's the damn drafts. 
Nothing in Get Cape Cod definitely seems a possibility now. Shit. I would love some sleep. <laughs> oh, that's something all right. <laughs> well, I that's worth it. Well, well, what do we have? Garbage! If only there were some bullets. What do we have here? Captain Chai. Got hit. While storming the Kutzweiher. I went after the infected. An open wound. Well, not It's obvious. I think you understand what has to be done. <coughs> what? You need to sleep like a fucking overgrown mutt. I'm a soldier. I followed orders. You owe me a bullet. Give it your way then, Captain. Incendiary! Ho! Won't budge, Comrade Major! What? You can't break one flimsy door! <laughs> Here! 
So we can burn everything here. But those guys are already gone. They're not going anywhere. How about Hansa? There's no way we can get them there. What do you care? Let the brass sort it out. We're just to do as they say. All right. Uh, it didn't seem quite like the rats. I should go and check. Well, the experiment has been successful. We need to report that to General Corbus. Will you go? Yes, sir. What's with the broad? Yesnitsky brought her. Says she's a hostage for negotiations with the Order. Although we all know what other negotiations they're having. Seems all here. Uh, too many shrooms after all. Looks like some fuck.
Number 47, rigor mortis, skin hemorrhages, none. What else? Conjunctiva hemorrhage, erosion of the palate mucous membrane, Imagination after looks like so. Imagination after me. Rigor mortis isn't really setting in. Skin hemorrhages, bleeding, standard clinical. So, should we look for. Hey, cool. 
Intruders! A job? Stand still, or I slid her drop. So, you came for Anna. Very heroic, but not very smart. Here is the deal. You take off your mask, and I give her to you. I'll count to five. Don't do this, Artyom. He'll kill me anyway. He already betrayed us once. One. You're wrong. Two. I never served. <laughs> Why? Why did you do that? <coughs> Hurry! <coughs> we have to get caught, Sovaya. <coughs> There's Hansa. <laughs> and our men. <laughs> Suffocating would be <laughs> a real shame after <laughs> surviving all that. of the puzzle are falling together and the big picture is horrifying and unbelievable I have a feeling that everything will end soon we won't survive this war Artyom no one will I feel alone again like when I was a girl and father was away on a mission nothing around me Empty and cold, as if I were just a spark from the fire, flying away and then gone. It's hard for me to tell you these things, Artyom, but I want to feel that I'm alive. Touch me.
Well, hmm. there seems to be nothing wrong with you. Congratulations, youngsters. You, Archeum, may go. While you, Anna, you have to stay some more. We need to finish treating your wound. Oh, thank God. Come here, darling. Don't look there. Who's What's that? that Papa? You see the face? Is it? it looks oh, like eight books. Yes, it's eight. Simetsky, Yuri. Oh! 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 Hey. So? What do I do now? Anybody? Good. So, I don't have to remind you about the gloves and the mask. Yes, I know that. So, are you able to isolate the agent? Yes and no. It is an Ebola virus, but trying to cultivate it is useless. It's basically non virulent now. Without the original strain. Doctor, you know I'm no medic. Please explain. Uh, I'm sorry, Colonel. Here are the facts. In the first two days, the mortality rate was around 95%. In the third, it dropped to about 25%. Today, we only have two new infected, and they have a light infection, prospects of recovery looking promising. Now, as you understand, Moscow never was a natural habitat for this virus, and in its wild form, it remains dangerous much longer. So, what does all this mean? It is not a regular virus. It's a weapons-grade strain, engineered to achieve maximum lethality within a short time, and then turn harmless. Damnation. Where did it come from? I have heard of a new generation of bioweapons based on this virus being developed before the Where did it serve us now? Step away! Away! No, that's how you go. You! Yes, you! You can come through! I'm happy to know that you and Anna are all right. We can't afford to waste time being sick now. The dark one we're looking for could really be the last one. We can't lose him. Let's go. I have to go. But I have to go back for her insulin. She'll die without it. You'll buy some here. I can't let you go. How can we buy anything when all we had is back there? And Hansa charged you so much. Please. Hansa gave you shelter. Stand back. Shelter to I die said stand back. So we stay for a little longer. Young man, you've seen what's happening here. They won't even let me go take the insulin. And I can't buy it. Everything we have is at home. Could you help me? Please. Thank you. I'm forever in your debt. Yes, the refugees sure were lucky, because Dublin's rangers were here. Corbett's men clearly didn't expect to be met with machine gun fire. So, all this stuff's still there? Well, Hansa could not protect the station without help, but they did provide shelter for the refugees. And the hospital. Perhaps that could help them. Sorry, that's forbidden without a permit. That's our man. Let this one through. We got permit. I think you should stock up on filters and ammo. We probably won't have such a chance anytime soon. Come here, Angel. I got the great weapons.
One of their fighters. Come back any time. Hey, Ranger. How about some ammo? Take a look. I bet you don't have these in Sparta. Just buy these. They'll prove a great investment. You don't have enough space. I'd be happy to sell, but you can't carry anymore. Come here, Ranger. Let's haggle. Hey, some throw in there. Cheap. Let's get the Nobody signed any contracts with them. We didn't even notice anything. What are they thinking? Artyom, take note of the funds Hanser expends on this quarantine. And they are generally quite reserved with their money. Perhaps they are aiming for an additional trump card to use in negotiations at Polis. Soon, the leaders of Hansa, Redline, and Reich will meet in Polis, hoping to reach a peaceful settlement on D6. But I know the nature of man all too well, Artyom. War is as certain as the fall of night, unless a miracle happens. Come through! Well... We won't catch the train with the Dark One moving along the tunnel. But there is another way. We're leaving the station. Here's our pass. All right. Are you going to Polis? No. Open the Interline Tunnel for me. But the Interline is a dead end, and very dangerous. A dead end? No way. That's our road to Polis. Open up. Let's go. Careful with the generators! As you see, it's no dead end. That's just what the Hanser authorities claim to discourage people from entering these passages. An unprepared man could easily lose his way here. Or even become lost within himself. But as long as you're with me, there is no danger. Most people believe Metro to be just tunnels and stations. A lifeless and soulless conglomerate created by human hands alone. There's a special place in the Metro. The few people who come upon it never return. I call it the River of Fate because it can change your destiny, wash away the silt of the past, and offer the chance for a different future. The 
man enters this river in dire need of such a chance, wishing desperately to learn it, then he might be carried to the place and time where that chance is granted. Remember, we must find the Dark One. It is the only thing we are to ask of the river. The Metro is a living, breathing thing, with a heartbeat, a soul, and a mind. Careful here. It's an abandoned place. of Hansa, Redline, and Reich will meet in Polis, hoping to reach a peaceful settlement on D6. But I know the nature of man all too well, Artyom. War is as certain as the fall of night, unless a miracle happens. Come through! the train with the dark one moving along the tunnel but there is another way Damn. we're leaving the station here's our pass all right are you going to polis no open the interline tunnel for me but the interline is a dead end and very dangerous a dead end no way that's our road to polis open up There's a special place in the metro. The few people who come upon it never return. I call it the River of Fate because it can change your destiny, wash away the silt of the past, and offer the chance for a different future. this river in dire need of such a chance, wishing desperately to earn it, that he might be carried to the place and time where that chance is granted. Remember, we must find the Dark One. 
It is the only thing we are to ask of the river. The Metro is a living, breathing thing, with a heartbeat, a soul, and a mind. We got to be careful here. Monsters, nothing else. Let's go. Something behind these cobwebs. Intriguing. Is that a sign? The grate is rusted and poorly attached. Give me a hand here, Artyom. One, two... Ah! Continue burning it, Artyom. Look, water. We're almost there. Pretty close. Stay here for long. This is it. The river of fame. Not so impressive, perhaps, on the surface. We have to enter the water.
Familiar scenery? It's the tower. And down there is the city of the Dark Ones. It's the moment you launch the missiles. Look, that's you. The river will cleanse you. Forgive your sins. You can change your fate. You can do it. Choose your destiny and be free. What's left is ashes and dust. Look, there he is. The Dark One. After him. Nobody. A dead end. Is this where you almost caught him? You must try again, Artyom. The Dark One. He's still at that freak show. On the train. in the desert of the real. When we Booster got out of the room, the dark one was Island, very close. We can't have gotten too Red far ahead. Here, sighting confirmed. Your position might be attacked. The evac train is considered our primary target. High alert! Come on, hop in. We need that miracle now, Artyom. Remember everything I told you about the Dark One. You must save him. And then he just might save us all. I never believed him.
The train's somewhere around here. I have this feeling. You hear that? That's the train! We were right! Artyom, darling, you're so big now. Mom, I'm scared. Don't be afraid. There is nothing to be afraid of now. Don't leave, Mom. I'm all alone now. You're not alone. You're the first. We remembered you and were waiting. We could remember all the thoughts of our race. And you killed everyone. And now I'm alone.
Of course.
Watch out! So high, we made the city so huge. Why are the people down there now? Why so few? Whatever my intentions concerning him might be, the little dark one just does not seem to care. He keeps falling. Time we go. You do not see them? You cannot see? Red. Dangerous. Many of them.
very fast, but I am working. Sometimes I see a door. Somebody calls for you from there. Why? We are coming to Polis. Yeah. Somebody there. Hard to see from here. People. Afraid of being attacked. But not evil. Where's your identification? I'm not fucking around! Shit. It's alright, people. Stand down. He's a police ranger. Going down the ring? Well, hurry up then. The road's empty. Didn't even want to let us through. I'm going to rest here for a while. We can do some trading if you want. Look at how these riddly targets with holes. These you can find only here. This is your chance. Come here. Let me exchange some ammo for you. Look, buy anything you want. All the ammo is the best quality. I shoot it myself, but a man's gotta eat. You need anything, come back while we're still resting. Come here, Ranger. You do understand I'm not unpacking all of my stuff. Just the best. People ahead, waiting for us. Eager to kill. Don't know where you get. Men hold us and fire hold. Learn every inch of this place, like the back of your hand. Yes, come with Lieutenant. Move out then. Nothing here either. Clear. Nobody here. The enemy sighted. Where? He disappeared! Look for him! We'll fail the mission if we don't find him! Got anything? 
I saw you have these. Good? Now I know what for. I'll bring more. I heal. I help. Not always enough strength for me. Kulagin, state meeting in Paul the Pass. We might still catch up with the caravan. Klimitsky, stay here. Yes, Comrade Lieutenant. Yes, sir. There's no catching them. They're long gone. We should try. Why? It's only one caravan. Because we have orders. The move out? I still don't think we'll catch up. Cleaning my boots the same way you kiss your mother with your fucking tongue. 
You got that speed up! Sir, yes, sir! I have a bad feeling. It's not like we're looking for your regular spot. Gotta watch our ass. Nice and slow. What's up? Where? You? Not this guy. Move on. Stay cool, man. Hey, let's look for the beach. Stay sharp. Seems nothing. Come on. Looks clear. Tip. Right. Let's cover each other. Keep your eyes. What the fuck here? What now? Let's go. I spend a beach close by.
Them again, black and red. They fear and still want to kill you. know him, and he knows you.
Kyle Lesnitsky. Everything all right here? Of course. Nothing ever happens in D6. Makes you wonder why we have to stand guard. Looks like something important. All right, position taken. Perfect, Lesnitsky. Now it is your turn, Comrade Morozov. We must field test this virus that we have obtained at such risk. I think you had some uh, associates suitable for the task? Yes, Cheslav Andreevich, out of Venice. His bandits think I'm one of them, and if we pay them... Spare me the details. I just need results. Is your task clear, Comrade Lesnitsky? Yes, Comrade General. You killed one of ours. You killed a ranger. Do you think we just let you go? We'll see about that. I have a trump card. You. See to it then. And you will have to handle Red Square, Pavel. It's the most critical part, and there's no one else I can trust with it. Do not let me down. I won't, Comrade General. Interesting. But I'm too tired. Need to stop. He is very bad. But you are right. Killing is worse. He who sows the wind shall reap the storm. The dark one opened up. Shadows here. Come. Don't see me. Don't hear. Alive and dead at once. Very strange. this, but try not to kill him.
strange. You can't see well with eyes. I see shadows better. I see shadows better. It was life than death. I don't find many of these.
with so many of these things. Here. We go up here, by the ladder? Now I know the word. Yes. There's a window. Watch out. He does not understand that he's dead. He's still waiting for his mother. But she is not coming. Mine neither. Because you people killed them all. not a shadow. You, yourself. Long, long ago.
know only one way into Polis. There's danger here. Not like before. I feel it. And we'll be with you. We'll tell you what to do. Stand. I will help. Do not disturb them, Martin. Stay close to me. I will help. Do not disturb them, Martin. Stay close to me. They've been here for so long. Lots of them. But they are all lonely. Only fear and pain. They can't leave, and want somebody to stay with them.
Guardian, there are bad people. Many. Very red. Opa! One more! Put your weapon on the ground and hands behind your head! I... Don't stand. I will help. No more. Too tired. What about yourself? Attack! I'm leaving it here, Carry out the order, please! You know you could have stayed at the red line. We would have taken you in. You just have to risk it, huh? And then come right here. You'd use your fucking hair sometimes, that's you want. Or what, maybe you thought Corbus forgot all about you? Not on your lifetime, D'Artagnan. And neither did I. You didn't like it our way, didn't want to join us, huh? He'll just have to buy the fucking dust here. Well, I'm sure this is getting easier. So go, go get, finish him. Attack! Let's avenge our comrades. Casualties are mounting! Mm. Spartan! 
You decided to show up? You got balls, huh? That's for sure. Come on, Ranger. Like you always do it, huh? But you're a chicken? You're a chicken or what? The test at Oktyabriskaya was successful. The virus kills fast and goes inert fast. If we can get enough of it, clearing out the whole metro is possible. But we must capture D6 first. Thus, Comrade Morozov, you have only one chance to pull this off. The Order has good fighters, but there are too few of them to cover all the entry points. Our scouts have located a poorly descended entrance through Kremlin. While Miller's at the peace conference in Polis, he will be unable to command his men. That's when we strike. Yes, a week longer, and then comes the dawn of a new age. Artyom, what's up with you? Hey, hey, my friend! Artyom! Decide. You go. You help. Decide. to make it to Polis in time for the peace conference. Something strange here. Wait.
She's protecting her children. Watch out! So bad. Vulnerable there. Over here! Thank God, you're in one piece. Brought a friend. Wait, is this? Arthur, this kid shouldn't be out there without a gas mask. What the fuck? Ah, so it is, so it is. A child of the surface, a dark one. No! Don't shoot him, Miller. Then get it away from me! No mask. I should have known. This one's green, but that one's yellow. Tell him I'm not a danger. It seems he is adept in that. Yes. That will keep him alive. May I talk to him, Artyom? Colonel Miller, put your fear aside. This child is the future. You need only take its hand. My hands are full enough. I doubt this creature can help us. But you too. You go on without me. For I give into better judgment and rid the earth of it. How is this? Oh, oh, I, I can understand his thoughts, and I can hear yours, Artyom. Can you hear anyone's thought just by touching them? With Artyom, it's different. We can talk from afar. He was... adopted long ago. What do you see, Artyom? The Dark Ones changed you, so that they could understand us! What's behind that door? Did you hear? They call you. I can hear. Open this! Wait. That looks like one of the sealed doors in D6. Yes, at the exhibition. It has a strong lock, too. We've yet to break it. What's there?
Incredible. Look at this. They're hibernating. He is not alone. I must wake them up. It's time for them to leave. We are all going there now. We'll open the door if we can. There's death nearby, all around. But I must wake them or be alone forever. Now listen. Help us and we'll help you. I will. What needs to be done? I must wake them. We'll have to improvise. Hey, wake, wake up, up, you bastards! bastards. Colonel, can you open the gate where the garden's line ends at D6? Do you have the code? I have all the codes for D6, but I can't promise a thing. You'll have to. He will help us in police if you do. Take him along then, and brief me on the way. If I'm convinced that he'll help us, I'll open your door. Follow me. He is not alone. Artyom, we already knew of Oktobriska from Khan. And we did confront Moskvin on this. Yet he didn't even try to disprove Open it. Gate. He told them by sheer luck their chemical defense squad was exercising nearby. And thus, despite some sacrifice, they were able to lift this darting epidemic in its birth. Otherwise, it would have engulfed the whole of Metro. What can you say to that? Even I would have done the same. But Colonel, it was Lasnitsky, the agent who stole a virus container from D6 right before the outbreak. So what? There is not a single living witness besides Artyom. Who'd believe the order? We have the D6 now. What if it was us who released the virus? But the Reds tried to break through into Hans's territory. We could make Moskvin. What can we do? We are not an army. We've less than a hundred fighters. Yes, yes Moskvin did gear up for war. But after Polis suggested that we share the wealth inside D6, he might actually agree to peace. And we must do everything to have that agreement signed. Moskvin? What difference does he make? He's just a puppet in Corbett's hands. And while he's talking, Corbett's forces are encircling you. You'll seal this peace agreement with your blood! What? You got a better idea? You brought this ape here! What now? We're done with this. Let's go to the council hall. Follow me. Permission to report, Colonel. Denied. Urgent dispatch to D6 Security Force Commander. Go to highest alert. Instruct Korneyev to proceed with... Well, he knows what to do. God, please let this work out. to the little one. Hurrah, comrades! Let there be peace in the name of our children! You are a liar! Khan, are you out of your mind? I know what I'm doing. Just believe in me. Just this one time. Who are you? Guards, take this man away. Ranger, stand down! Artyom, little one, it's your turn. Comrade Moscovin, you must support me on this. Or else... 
Some inconvenient details might surface concerning your brother's death. I overheard one conversation between your brother and his advisor about the threat you pose and ways to eliminate it. What's the hell? Threat? We're brothers! He thinks you feel bypassed, cheated. He fears you will overthrow him. <laughs> He's totally mad. Totally. I'm going to give him an earful. Words alone will not avert his assassination plans. No, you must strike first. Maxim, brother. I'm so pleased that we finally made up. It was a fight over nothing. Let's have a drink. Sure, brother. those honest eyes for. It was your fault. Who wanted me dead? Corbett sold you out. And now, he's got me by the balls. All because of you. Sorry? I'm so sorry, brother. There's no forgiveness for me. But even so... I gave something to brother. Yes! Yes! I did. I poisoned him. And Corbett. I'm a fool. I thought he wanted to save me. And he just took the power. Took me by the throat. And he's storming the D6 now. And there's that virus. And if that falls into Corbett's hands, the end. You but you scum. are the leader. They order no him. Is. Call the troops back. You stole them at least. Buy some time to make a deal. What kind There's of... nothing more we can do here. Hurry. Man. Faster. To the platform. Damn them. I'm not surrendering D6. Follow me. It will be bad for everyone if you lose? Then I will ask for their help.
Moskvin wasn't bullshitting this time. The Red Line's advancing on three sides. My brother's in arms. I am not a man for speeches, but here it is. You are the most dedicated, most courageous soldiers in the Metro. Each of you is worth five reds. If you simply do the job you were trained to do, we'll win this battle. Sparta, to battle! Sparta! Sparta!
Colonel, wounded are out of the fire zone and headed to the evac point. Well done. Regroup and get ready. We're going to go at it again any moment now. Yes, sir. Our only option is to destroy it. Count us in, sir. What the hell? Nobody lives forever. What the hell is this? Shit! Not again! Unforgivable waste of men and resources. So many good soldiers lost. And for what? Police station? The council? Ah, well. All are cleansed by the fires of revolution. What a pleasant surprise, Colonel Miller. Or oh, what remains of you? Artyom, it is time. <laughs> Who might this be? Ah, the resourceful young man. Tell me, Arthur, savior of the metro. Where are you going? Arthur, no need for that now.
Ullman died, like most of the Spartans. Miller survived and is now in charge of police guards, even though he's confined to a wheelchair. And Khan just disappeared. He once told me, what if this little dark one is the last of the angels sent to save us? The fact that the little one came back and brought his kin, maybe that was the pardon and salvation for me, for the Order, for all of us in the Metro. The last light of hope in this kingdom of darkness. It will be better for everyone if we go away, Odin. But one day we'll come back. I'll be big then. Goodbye, my friend. The Dark Ones are gone. But I know we will meet again. Maybe... They really were sent to save us. Maybe... We did earn forgiveness.